Hello everyone. So I've been meaning to make this video a really long time. It's been requested by a lot of people. Um, this is how to sex a centipede and how to tell the difference. Uh, and this is going to hopefully simplify it because I know there's a lot of stuff online and it doesn't make it simple. So what we got in front of us is our centipedes. We got some water chilled to 33 Fahrenheit, so it's very, very cold. It's just above freezing. Um, and then we got our sexing platter here. So let's get moving right along. We're going to go ahead and put the ice water into these. So a lot of people are bothered by this part. I will tell you the centipede is not being hurt. I am not killing it. Um, obviously it doesn't like being in water. Um, but... Uh, this is how we put them to sleep. They might flail around a little bit. I like the colder water because it works faster. Um, and so that's basically what you do. Now we're going to let it fall asleep. We're going to get the water in the other one too. Now a good way to tell that they're asleep is they're not moving anymore. Now these ones are obviously still moving a little bit so they're not quite asleep. Um, if you use water with actual ice cubes in it, they'll fall asleep very fast. I didn't do that this time, I just used uh, water at 33 Fahrenheit as I said. Um, anyways, uh, these guys will be asleep any second here now, so I'm going to start sexing them and I'm going to show you the difference in the genitalia. Now to sex them, you're going to gently apply pressure and then work it up and that's going to push your sex organs out just like that. Okay. Now on the sides, I don't know if we can see here, I'll go ahead and get it in the light so we can see the spinning organs. This is a male. So here we are, hopefully you can see this, that little spiky thing sticking out on either side there of the sex organ. That's the spinning organ. Um, now females are not going to have this, I'll show you a female now, okay? This is a male again, look at those little spiky things, that's the spinning organ. He's waking up, so... We're going to move along. Try to get as close as I can. Okay, so let's move to the female. Now notice on the female the absence of the spinning organ. It's more protruded and rounded. No spikes on the side of the sex organ. So that's the difference between a male and a female. Again, those spikes are on the side of the sex organ, so they're going to stick out the little points. You, you've seen them, obviously, in the video there. But we'll go ahead and put her and the male back. We had a male and a female there, um, and we'll let them uh, wake back up here. So anyways, that's the uh, sexing tutorial. Thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, share this anywhere you can. Hopefully this uh, sheds some light on to uh, correctly sexing a centipede. Um, try not to crush the centipede when you sex it, of course. But do push the sex organs out. It can be a little tricky sometimes, but again, just do what I did on here and it will work out for you. Um, they, they take about a minute to wake up and that's why I like the icing method also. The ice water, um, I should touch this before I end the video, um, I prefer it over CO2. CO2 poisoning is a real thing and it does happen. So to avoid that, just use ice water. They wake right up, they don't die. Um, also, it, it works faster than room temperature water. I used to use room temperature water, I don't do that anymore. I just use straight, really cold water, just above freezing. Anyway, she's going to get away, so thank you guys for watching.